Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In this tutorial, I will show you how you can install Ubuntu Server in a VMware Workstation 17 Pro in Windows 11 operating system. Let's begin. So let's go to the Ubuntu website. It's ubuntu.com. And then look for the download section here. And let's look for the ubuntu server and click the ubuntu server download ubuntu server 22.04 lts and as you can see it's starting to uh, download the iso image let's wait to finish it it's almost done it's completed let's uh, open the folder it's here now so let's go back to our vmware workstation and let's create a new virtual machine let's click on file new virtual machine click next and then let's uh, point it to the download folder open and next let's name it ubuntu server for windows And I will just leave it as is the default location. Next, and I'll make it 50 gig. The split virtual disk, next. And then I'm gonna customize the hardware settings here. And from the network adapter, I need to select the bridge network. Um, and I can make this eight gig with two processor. Enable the virtualized Intel VT just to make sure. Close and then finish. Power it on. And then let's wait to start the installation process. Enter. Let's make it a little bit bigger. Okay, just uh, press Enter, English. Continue without updating. Enter. Enter. So let's just choose an IP address via the DHCP. Enter. And then enter. Let's wait if it's a successful one. Okay. Location pass test. Then enter. Then just uh, use the default settings. Enter. And then done. Are you sure you want to continue? Continue. Enter. Then let's name it as Belray's Toolkit. Let's name it Ubuntu Server 1 Belray's Toolkit. Let's enter the password, re enter the password. Enter. Skip it for now about the uh, Ubuntu Pro. Press continue and then enable the OpenSSH server. It's up to you if you want to enable it or not. Then enter and then just enter. Then let's wait to finish installing the system. It's now installing the OpenSSH server. It's almost done. Um, let's just uh, wait for a few minutes here let's just wait to um, download and install the security updates and then it will after that it will ask us to reboot the uh, server it's completed then let's reboot the virtual machine reboot now and then let's wait enter Okay, let's just enter and then let's use the username that we specified during the installation. Valerie's toolkit and then my password. Now we're in. Um, let's just finish the uh, click the I finished installing. And let's do if config. Okay, let's do IPA. This is the IP address 50.28. Dig google.com if you have a 
connection to the internet we have you now have a running ubuntu server that's all for now thank you Thank you.